Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have a new... What is up guys? Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have a new video for you guys today. It's gonna be my first Q&A video here on this channel. So let's get this popping. So please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and share for more content in the future, and let's get started. So first question is, what's your favorite color? So my favorite color is um, red. I recently got, I recently started liking red about like a few months ago. I never really was into it, but um, I guess you could say red is my favorite color. It used to be blue. Loki still is, but like, it it randomizes at times. It goes back and forth. So at the moment, it's red. So next question. Uh, what is your favorite food? So my favorite food is, <sighs> oh, let's see my favorite food. All right, easy. My favorite food is tacos. I really like tacos a lot. Like I like going to Taco Bell. I like Del Taco. I like getting tacos from Jack in the Box. Like those are my favorites. Like tacos for sure, my my favorite food. I also like chicken too. Chicken and burgers and stuff. Uh, I need to stay away from it though, cause you know, you know what I'm saying. What's one of your biggest goals in life? All right, so one of my biggest goals in life. Um. One of my biggest goals in life is to grow up, uh, start up a family, get a nice home, have beautiful kids in the future, nice wife, all that type of stuff. And yeah, that's one of my biggest goals is to achieve that later on in life. So hopefully I get that in the future. Next question is, does your mom and parents know you smoke? What? Of course they know I smoke. I smoke all the time. Like, what are they, what? <sighs> like. Come on now, you already know what's up. Who inspired you to start making YouTube videos? Okay, so I have a lot of people I look up to on YouTube that really inspired me. So I'm just name off a few. The number one person that made me start YouTube, I would say is Casey Neistat. I used to watch his video so much about a year ago, and he's like the main person that pushed me to like start making videos of my own, but Around that time, it didn't really work out of how I wanted it to, and so I basically quit for a while. But I also still have a video coming up soon on like explaining like everything on where I've been, like why I wasn't posting videos in that time and all that. But yeah, Casey Nasset for sure. Second person that helped me, or the second person that really motivated me, or I look up to, is I should say DDG. Um, Pontiac made DDG. He's a good, funny YouTuber. I look up to him a lot. So. I get I get most of my ideas and like video ideas from him and like I really look up to him as well. So the last person I would say is Deshay Frost. He's also a friend of DDG. Deshay, me and we're like the same, we're the same age. She's 18, I'm 18. But yeah, he's a cool guy or whatever. I look up to him as well. So those are all the people that basically inspired me to do YouTube. Who are your top three favorite artists of all time? Number one, I'm gonna say right now, number one, he's always gonna be my favorite, has always been my favorite since I was young, youngin, back in middle school, is Drake. Drake is my number one favorite. Wait, whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. Pause. Okay, dang, this is gonna be hard. I don't know. Okay, I don't know what kind of, I don't know if I'm gonna put it in order, but I'm gonna just say this. Number one, Travis Scott. Travis Scott is my favorite artist of all time, hands down. Travis Scott, his music goes so hard. I've been rocking with him since right after he released Days Before Rodeo. That's when I started rocking with Travis. And then he released Rodeo, heard that album, thought it was fantastic. That's a classic. And after that, Birds and the Trap Sing McKnight, also a good album. And after that, Continuing on up to Astral World and like where he is now that I've been rocking with him for a while Second person is Drake 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 is also a girl. He's one of my favorite rappers as well. I've always been listening to Drake for a while too. Um, honestly lately, I've been off Drake to be honest His last few projects those were very good albums that he released but the newest one Scorpion uh, It's alright to me. It's, it's cool. It's alright. It's different, but um 
I, n I never really liked it like that, but he's cool as well. And my last artist, my last favorite artist I to say is Gunna. Gunna, he's cool. Gunna's cool. I recently started listening to Gunna about like last year. So yeah, I'll say Gunna, he's cool too. What are a few things you are grateful for? I'm grateful for number one, my health and strength, that I'm able to be alive, to go to sleep, wake up a good day. And see another day, I mean, wake up happy, feel good. So yeah, um, I'm also thankful for my family. Without them, I don't know where I would be at this point. They've always supported me throughout everything that I've been through. I'm also grateful for my beautiful girlfriend. She's helped me with a lot. I really appreciate her. And finally, a few of my close friends, they mean so much to me. They've always been there at times, but yeah, that's basically what I'm grateful for. What are your favorite shoes that you've bought? My favorite shoes, uh, one of my favorite shoes I bought are the, let's see, the moment. I talked about it in my other video, but I'm gonna just say it again, the Bread Fours. The Bread Fours. Those are hard. Those shoes are my favorite shoes by far that I bought. I don't even wear them like that no more, but um, those are my favorite shoes that I bought so far. Do you have a job? And if so, where do you work at? Uh, yes, I do have a job. I'm actually in the process of looking for another one, I should say, but I currently work at In-N-Out, In-N-Out Burger. It's a cool place to work at, it's all right. I really enjoyed it. I've been there for about a year and a half now, it's cool. But I think it's time that I wanna just go out and see about like other things I can experience, you know, like jobs and stuff like that. Or maybe YouTube. YouTube is a good job that people do. So hopefully I might just decide to keep doing this. You know, I might blow up someday, I don't know. But yeah, next question is, what do you like to do for fun? Um, What do I like to do for fun? I would say I enjoy going out places like the mall or to the beach. Well, not, not really the beach, because like hate the beach, honestly. It messes my skin every time I go there. But number one, I like going to the mall. I also like driving around to different places. I like that a lot. Um, that's really it for that. Where do you see yourself in the next few years? In the next few years, I see myself in college still, because this is my first year of college. But I would see myself in college a little bit. Hopefully, I'll be out of UC, like UCLA which is my dream school, so hopefully I end up there. I also see myself in a good, healthy relationship as well. Um, I can see myself, if I stay consistent to this, keep doing YouTube videos and start gaining followers and stuff. What's one of your goals for YouTube? One of my goals for YouTube is actually um, getting up to a thousand subscribers. I honestly wanna get up to a thousand subscribers. Like that's my goal. I'm close to 100, so please leave a like, comment, do all that, close to 100. But um, get to 100, then 200, 300, 400, 500. If I hit 500, man, I'm gonna be so, I'm gonna just be so proud of myself if I hit 500 subscribers. So that's my goal for YouTube. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna wrap up the video here. I actually gotta start getting ready for work. I gotta go. So please hit that subscribe button. Also like, comment, and share for more content in the future. I'm gonna see you guys soon with a new video, so stay tuned. All right, peace out.